Hey everybody, this is Should You Read, a series where we talk about and give a book recommendation on a book we just read. So the book that I read was Stormfront, which is the first book in the Dresden File series. It was very, very good. I enjoyed it a lot. Um, this one I'd like to go into and tell you why I liked it and uh, recommend it to you guys. I think uh, most people will like it and I'll tell you why. Be back in just a sec. Bye. All right, so Stormfront is the first book in the Dresden Files series, like I said, by Jim Butcher. Um, I think this is even his first book. I'll have to look that up and see to make sure. I really enjoyed it. I found it very engaging. I read the physical copy and I listened to the audiobook. The audiobook is narrated by James Marsters, which is uh, Spike from Buffy. Um, he was also Brainiac from Smallville. He played other, uh, some other small roles, too. But those are the things that I remember him from. So the book's about 300 pages. It's not an intimidating read. A lot of people, you know, they get nervous when they see like an 800 or 1,000 page book. This is not that. It's a nice, easy read. I was able to read it in about two days. Um, so if that's what you're into, this is gonna be a perfect book for you because it's a great introduction into a series and it's a short book. So I think you'd really enjoy it. So really the best summary of the book is right here in the first chapter. I'm gonna read it to you, it's really great. So, my name is Harry Blackstone Copperfield Dresden. Conjure it by at your own risk. I'm a wizard. I work out of an office in Midtown Chicago. As far as I know, I'm the only openly practicing professional wizard in the country. You can find me in the yellow pages under wizards. Believe it or not, I'm the only one. My ad looks like this. Harry Dresden. Wizard. Lost items found. Paranormal investigations. Consulting. Advice. Reasonable rates. No love potions. Endless purses, parties, or other entertainment. I mean, that <laughs> that describes it pretty well. I think I, it had enough humor in it that it was, um, I found myself giggling a couple times. It was serious at times. And um, it had some real stakes in it. You felt like for a little while that Harry wasn't going to make it. I mean, you kind of know he's going to make it because you've got like 10 other books in the series. I'm assuming if you read it for the first, first time as the book came out, you would think, man, this guy might not make it if this was a one-off book, you know? But really, really enjoyed it. Um, can't say much more about it. I found it very entertaining. It's not high fantasy where it's a whole new world. So it was based in Chicago, so you already know some things about the city. You don't come in blind like you do with epic fantasy where it's a whole new world. That's something that might be a little bit easier for some people to get into as well. So for me, it was such an enjoyable read. I would definitely recommend it to others. Um, if you're a fan of fantasy, I think you're going to enjoy this book. If um, you're looking for something really interesting and intriguing and in-depth, this isn't for you. I mean, it's kind of surface level, getting you into the story. You just meet Harry. You don't really meet any side characters other than a few people he interacts with. So I already picked up book two. I'm excited to get to reading that one. Let me know what you think down in the comments below. I think it's um, going to be a neat series that we're going to read through. Might do Should You Read on all of them or once after the first couple, you guys are like, you know, We'll, we'll just go and do a straight book discussion. So you let me know what you think in the comments. Go ahead and like the video if you can. Um, if you're not subscribed and you like what we're doing here, that'd be awesome. I'd love for you to subscribe to the channel and see what we're doing. Also, there's going to be a link for the Discord down below. I'm doing some giveaways there, posting funny memes, kind of just chit-chatting back and forth. We'd love to have you as well. So let us know. The Amazon affiliate link will be down in the description, and I've signed up for book depository affiliate links too that I can try to get to you guys as well. So let me know if either one of those are a good option for you or if you want to do something else. I'd love to do that as well. It was great to talk with you, and we'll see you next time.